Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Axe, and today I'm going to show you how to search real world documents with your smartphone. Now when you're looking at a website and you're trying to find a keyword, you hit Ctrl F to search the page. Well, wouldn't it be nice if you could do that with signs and documents in the real world? That's what the development team at ControlF.io was thinking when they created their latest Android app, which is called Control F. It lets you take a picture of any printed text, then quickly converts that image into a searchable PDF so that you can find keywords in an instant. You can download the app for free on the Google Play Store, so search it by name to get it installed, or use the link in step one in my full tutorial. And when you first launch Control F, you'll have to grant a single permission if you're running Marshmallow or higher, so tap allow here. Beyond that, it may take a couple of seconds to get everything ready on first run, but when you make it to the main screen, you'll be ready to start searching documents. For this part, start by tapping the floating action button in the bottom right corner, then your camera's viewfinder will open. So just point your phone at the text you want to search, then tap the shutter button, and press the check mark when you're done with that. From here, you'll see a tip that explains how the text should always be right side up, and that you can use the following menu to rotate the image if it's not. So from here, drag the little blue dots around to crop the image, and try to get rid of everything that isn't text. When you're done there, hit the check mark, then you'll be prompted to select a language. If you're not bilingual, you might as well tick the box next to always use English, then press OK. From here, the app will straighten your image and tune it a bit to make the text more legible. And when it's done there, it'll scan the document to basically read every printed word. Once that's done, you'll be ready to search the document. So tap the floating action button again, then just type in your query. As you can see, it highlights every instance of the word you're searching, just like your browser would do if you were viewing a web page. Then, while you're at it, you can even tap the three dot menu button at the top of the screen to save this image as a searchable PDF, which is handy if you want to come back later and search for something else. So it's a really cool app with practical applications, and so far, I've been amazed at how well it works. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.